Okay, let's get to know Incineroar. Incineroar is a dual-type fire-dark Pokemon introduced in Generation 7. Incineroar is the fully evolved form of Litten, the fire starter of the Alola region. It is a humanoid feline Pokemon with a muscular build. Incineroar is based on a tiger. It also shares elements with professional wrestlers. Its secondary dark type may be a reference to a heel, a wrestler who embodies vice, in contrast to a face who embodies virtue. This Pokemon has a violent, selfish disposition. If it's not in the mood to listen, it will ignore its trainer's orders. Although it's rough-mannered and egotistical, it finds beating down unworthy opponents boring. It only gets motivated from stronger opponents. Its flame belt is produced from within its body, and flames burst from its navel and waist as its fighting spirit rises. Incineroar appears as a playable fighter in Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. Its signature Z-move, Malicious Moonsault, is its final smash. Official artwork for Incineroar was leaked on the internet 145 days before its actual reveal. Here's the shiny form. Like and follow! Okay, let's get to know Electivire. Electivire is a pure electric type Pokemon introduced in Generation 4. It evolves from Electabuzz when traded or exposed to an electrolyzer. And it is the final form of Elekid. When it gets excited, it thumps its chest. It pushes the tips of its two tails against its foe, then lets loose with over 20,000 volts of electricity. Its ability Motor Drive allows it to take no damage from electrical moves and raise its speed stat. A single Electivire can provide enough electricity for all the buildings in a big city for an entire year. It may also be based on a Yeti, an ape-like cryptid that was said to inhabit the Himalayas. The mark on its back resembles an electrical socket, and its horns are based on Tesla coils. Electivire was the first Generation 4 Pokemon to debut in the anime, not including movies. Paul, Ash's rival, also had an Electivire, and it had a fierce rivalry with Ash's Infernape. In the Super Smash Bros. series, Electivire appears on the electric terrain of the Pokemon Stadium 2 stage. Here's the shiny form. Like and follow! Okay, let's get to know Litwick. Litwick is a dual-type Ghost and Fire Pokemon introduced in Generation 5. It evolves into Lampent at level 41, and then into Chandelure when it's exposed to a Dusk Stone. Litwick is a small, candle-like Pokemon with a purple flame on top its head, which is powered by the life energy that it absorbs. Its body is primarily made of white wax, and it has some melted wax that lays over the right eye and leaves only the bright yellow left eye visible. Because tonight will be the night! It pretends to guide people and Pokemon around by illuminating darkened areas. However, it is actually sucking away their life energy and leading them to the ghost world. This Pokemon takes lost children by the hand to guide them into the spirit world. The younger the life this Pokemon absorbs, the brighter and eerier the flame on its head burns. In a 2011 Japanese interview translated by the YouTuber Dr. Lava, lead Pokemon designer Ken Sugimori revealed that a flame pre-evolution was planned for Litwick, but it was ultimately scrapped in favor of Chandelure. Here's the shiny form. Like and follow. Okay, let's get to know Cacnea. Cacnea is a grass-type Pokemon introduced in Generation 3. It evolves into Cacturn starting at level 32. Cacnea lives primarily in dry desert areas and attacks by swinging its pin-covered arms around like hammers. Its yellow flowers bloom twice a year, and it releases a strong aroma from its flower to attract its prey. When its prey comes near, the Pokemon shoots sharp thorns from its body to bring the victim down. By storing water in its body, this desert dweller can survive for up to 30 days without water. Cacnea debuted in a poached ego. James caught it right after he had to release his wheezing. James's Cacnea is the only Cacnea to have ever appeared in the anime. Cacnea and its evolution are the only grass-type Pokemon in the human-like egg group. Cacnea may be based on a barrel cactus, or possibly a jack-o'-lantern. Here's the shiny form. Like and follow! Okay, let's get to know Starly. Starly is a dual-type normal flying Pokemon introduced in Generation 4, and it is known as the Starling Pokemon. It evolves into Star Ravia starting at level 14, and then evolves into Star Raptor starting at level 34. It usually lives and travels in large flocks, so a single Starly will go unnoticed. To make up for this, its call is very noisy and annoying. Though small, they flap their wings with great power. It likes to prey on small bug Pokemon and Cherubi. In Generation 5, Starly's hidden ability was Keen Eye, but that was its normal ability as well, meaning it was the only Pokemon without a hidden ability that evolved into one that does have one. Staravia and Star Raptor's hidden ability is Reckless. In Gen 6 and onwards, this was fixed and Starly was given the Reckless ability as well. Starly is based on a young, white-cheeked Starling. Ash had a Starly in the anime and it was caught in episode 468, two degrees of separation. Starly has its own trophy in Super Smash Bros. Brawl. Here's the shiny form. Like and follow. Okay, let's get to know Feraligator. Feraligator is a pure water type Pokemon in the fully evolved form of Totodile, the water starter of the Johto region. They are incredibly powerful Pokemon and can physically split boulders with ease. 
It is hard for it to support its own weight out of water, so it gets down on all fours. Although it has a massive body, its powerful hind legs enable it to move quickly, even on the ground. When it bites with its massive and powerful jaws, it shakes its head and savagely tears its victim apart. For alligator, it appears to be based on a crocodilian. The yellow marking on its belly might be a reference to the yellow stripes of a young American alligator. For alligator reaches its final evolutionary form earlier than any other starter Pokemon, at level 30. However, Totodile evolves at level 18, the latest of any basic starter Pokemon tied with Turtwig, so it kind of balances out. For Alligator is the only fully evolved Johto starter Pokemon to appear in Poke Park Wii, Pikachu's adventure. The shortening of Gator into Gator in its name is a result of the 10 character limit on English Pokemon names in Generation 2. Here's the shiny form. Like and follow.